Hey Faith Church, it's Esther it, um, coming to you from Embu, Kenya. Welcome to Numba to Numba. <laughs> and we're, uh, we're outdoors enjoying a beautiful evening in, uh, at Shunem and in our Torchbearers Bible School. And uh, we have three of our young adults from Faith here to just give a little nugget of what they've been experiencing here at Bible School. So we'll start with Emily. Hi, um, I'm Emily, as you guys probably know. Um, I've been at the Angaza Bible School for, um, just finished our third week and are heading into our fourth. Uh, it's been a really amazing experience here in Kenya, just getting to see different faith communities from around the world and connecting with the body of Christ here in Kenya. Um, I've been learning so much at the different classes and hearing all of the teachers speak about their own life experiences, but also what they've learned about God and the Bible throughout their whole life. Um, I've really enjoyed the community here and getting to know the other students and just being able to talk about God so freely and passionately with people. Like during free time today, me and a couple students were just comparing our editions of the Bible and like debating about Romans and talking about like what we think of the um, books of some of the books that didn't make it into the Bible and like all of that different things. And it was just a really fun experience to have and I'm excited to finish out my week here. Hi everyone, my name is Noel. Um, and I would say one of my favorite parts has honestly been um, some of the times of both kind of solitude and then the times of, I guess you could call leisure as well. But um, we have mostly class all mornings, but, but um, during the day we have maybe an hour to four hours depending on the day of, of time for, for devotion, for personal devotion, um, which is spent in, in the many gardens around this place. And that's been such a valuable time for me to just step away from all the classes. The classes can be sometimes like drinking from a fire hose. And so being able to step away and look over notes and summarize and then go into those discussions like Emily's talking about with uh, really fresh perspectives and, and um, seeking further understanding from people, but also just the ability to um, teach each other games. I've, I've learned games from the Kenyans and the Kenyans have learned games from us. We've just connected so well over card games and sports and lots of football slash soccer and uh, just plenty of time to enjoy um, just the creation here um, and one another. And um, yeah, some of the staff here at Shunem will even come out and play football with us. So we've gotten close with them and uh, it's just been a wonderful opportunity to, to develop community. Hi everyone, I'm Barakat and um, I've really enjoyed my time here as well. Just like these two mentioned, I really like the fellowship of um, just the different cultures coming together to be united in Christ. I think even the teachers are from around the world and the staff here has been so open to us coming and open to us trying and experiencing what they have to offer. Um, I think one of the biggest lessons I've been learning through all of the classes is just the importance of continual obedience in our Christian walk with God um, to be further sanctified. And so that's something I'll be taking home with me and hopefully um, yeah, continuing to do in my life so that I can grow closer with Christ. Thanks for listening. We are heading back to the U.S. In, uh, on Saturday, uh, returning home around Sunday, and we are just looking forward to having great conversations with you uh, to tell you all about it. And uh, in the meantime, thank you so much for your prayers. We send our blessings to you. Bye-bye. Bye. -bye. Bye. Bye.